is Rumi Neely from FashionToast.com with Rocco from Fashion News Live. Hey, welcome to Fashion News Live. I am your host, Rocco. Next to me is uh, the, one of the models from the show. I mean, you could be a model, but your name is Rumi Neely, right? <laughs> You're a blogger. and yeah, you, you I have, have a blog called FashionToast.com. Mm -hmm. FashionToast.com, where yeah. you go and you watch shows and you give your expertise on what you see, right? Um, it's kind of a mishmash of just what I'm into, what I'm wearing, what I'm buying, um, what I'm doing. I mean, it's, I think it's really boring, but <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's like a, basically my life in photographs and writing on the internet and um, my experiences at Fashion Week and how I document them and my favorite parts. I mean, that's pretty much it. It's really simple. Do you know what I love? What I love, a, like, I just, just adore? I love the fact that we are taking over the internet. Like, it's not all about the big networks anymore. It's about online content. With you with your blogs and me with my video stuff that I do, we are now finally getting respect where before we didn't. Like, there was this whole article how bloggers are really representing this generation. And I, I think it's so rewarding and so awesome for all the hard work we've done. I mean, I know that you're ranked way up there, number one, with your blog. I'm ranked way up there with my videos. And how did you start out with all that? I mean, I seriously am the most normal girl you'll ever come across. I just like throwing together random clothes from the thrift store and then also designer shoes and I mix it all up and I don't, I don't know, I think it's a really, really simple thing and maybe people just like that I'm maybe more approachable in that sense. I'm not someone who's extremely privileged and I didn't have any fashion contacts when I first started my blog and never thought anyone was going to read it. So it's all very, been very organic and natural and hopefully that's what people are drawn to, you know? I think, I think the real factor is what people are attracted to. It's just, it's real. What we see is what we get. There's no BS. There's no, oh, well, I deserve to be this because I'm this. And it's just raw. And that's yeah. awesome. So what are you wearing? I'm wearing an Alexander Wang sweater, um, Zara pants, and Topshop boots. So it's kind of like a high-low mix all the time, you know? <laughs> and what about your jewelry? Um, this is by a designer oh called God, Mr. This is Kate. so cool. This is Pamela Love, who I'm obsessed with. Oh, my, that, check this out, guys. That is so freaking cool. It has a hinge. It's fully functional, so I don't have to <laughs> compromise <laughs> like, mobility. Oh God, yeah, so that's great. And then this is um, from a design collaboration I'm doing with Danny Joe here in New York. This one is, as is with Arrowhead. So it's really exciting to get opportunities like that, of course. And then this is Pamela Love. And for 21. <laughs> that is so cool. I love how you put your outfit together. So now, much. what advice would you give out there that to people that you're actually you're um, you're a role model to? They're aspiring to follow in your footsteps. They also start their blog, and they're like, "Oh my gosh, you know, this woman or this girl really motivated me to start my own thing." What What would you tell them all right now? We have 500,000 people that we reach out to every day. That What would you tell all those no people? No pressure. Um, <laughs> no, there's no, there's nobody for that watching. There. There, there's no That's one watching really us. All right. So what what, what, um, what advice would you give me if I want to start my let blog? Let me think. I think just to be yourself is the most important thing. I mean, I think it's kind of hard sometimes to filter out these trends because there's so much online now and everyone's kind of like gravitating towards the same things and I think that the most important thing is to just be yourself and wear what you feel you know naturally drawn to because then you know you will naturally get that unique look in that sense I think that's what I try to stay true to and hopefully other people can too thank you so much for your time hey stay tuned for a lot more fashion news live right here from mercedes-benz fashion week spring summer 2011 what you see is what you get what you read on her blog <laughs> is really the raw truth what was the blog again fashiontoast.com fashiontoast.com check Thank it out you so much.